Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Little Big Workshop. Alright, we got another set of assembly stations set up, so let's see if we can't get three different contracts going at once. Ooh, what is this? $144, that's not worth it. Alright, let's pause it while we figure out what we're gonna make here. Okay, so we can definitely make office desk. Even though the price is going down, $1,000 is still pretty dang good. So let's make 40 desks. Yeah, so it looks like batch turns off every time you restart the game. All right, and let's actually, where's the assembly? Here's assembly. Let's keep it, this assembly over here by the woodworking. That should be good to go. All right, so sandboxes should all be happening. Let's overdrive all this. Sandboxes should all be happening up there. So now we can do one more thing, maybe something with metalworking. Let's see. I got little stools. I'm still looking for something like at least 700 per. I feel like that's a really good zone. 700, 800, 1000. Fortunately, those grills aren't a whole lot. This isn't quite a thousand. That definitely is not. That's like what, 350? That's not bad, although that's probably a bit to make a chair with arms and everything. Advanced. Can make a grill. 2,000. Although, we got two, just two days to make that. Oh, that's a lot of metalworking. A lot of metal and woodworking. Let's see, is there something that's strictly metal? Maybe this. What is that? Wait, whoa, whoa. What is this? Oh, market manipulation. Got it. Let's see, something that's strictly metal working. Could do like robotics. A mini bot, what is this? Let's see. Oh, is the other one easier? Okay, that one's easier. Holy cow. Let's try to do something a bit easier. Oh my God. That's just a whole lot of metal working. It's a little too much for my liking. Okay, those two are just delivered, so that's fine. None of those seem to matter, so it's this, the track is kind of a pain. That's a lot of casting. Although, I don't really care about casting though, right? Because we have like seven foundries? Maybe we go with like this guy? Oh, that's a lot. Yeah, maybe we keep it at this bottom one. All right, let's keep everything at the base metals. And then, what is this? Choose how to create this component. Wait, what? Wait, what? Or we can get it delivered. Why can't I get it delivered? Wait. Wait a second. Before it was just getting delivered, right? Yeah, we could just totally get that delivered. All right. Cast that, base metals, base metals, and then yeah, we'll figure out where it all goes after this. And we'll see if we can alter some things. Alright, so that's the basics, so we need one more robotic. Okay, let's just start upping everything then. Is there anything that can up robotics right off the bat? Uh, it doesn't look like it, actually. Really? Nothing can up robotics here. What if we just up all of these to better metals? What does that change? Wow, that changes like a whole lot of nothing. So that's three robotics. That's one to three. That's six. So that's nine. That's ten. How do we have thirteen, then? Or is that one? So that's four. I'm a little lost. Okay, so we have six robotics here. Plus three here is nine. Plus four here is 13. Okay, so we need one more. How do we get one more? It says four to eight. Why can't I get a better one for this? Yeah, won't let me get a better one for that part. 
All right, what about this one? One, two, three. I picked the best one for that. So that's stuck there. What about this mini chassis? We can go for an eight. That'll do it. Okay, so that gets our robotics. So now we need better style. So go that for style. Already got the max style for all this. Oh. So this is not great. Okay, so we're short on style and strength? Are you kidding me? Do we have to make this arm? Is that what's going on? Four to eight. Oh, we probably got to go with the mini upper arm, don't we? Yeah, that instantly turns out all green. I mean, this is going to be just a lot of casting, right? Which it's going to take a bit, but we can totally pull it off, I think. It's going to be the easiest to make out of these. It's all like the same amount of operator. Definitely not that one. All right. Let's go with this one. Cast it. Metal bend it. We'll keep it all in metal for this. Basic casting. All the base metals. Yeah, base metals all around. Keep it cheap. Cheap as possible. Uh, yellow there. Base metal there. All right. I think that's good. All right, this is gonna be a lot, a lot of casting, but it should honestly be fine. Like I said, we have seven small foundries, so as long as stuff is getting done. Two metal bendings, which is fine. Assembly, so we'll keep assembly for this here and here. I think I did the same one twice there. More f forging, more assembly, more casting again, some plastics here or there, more assembly, more casting, more assembly, and some rolling, some pressing, and some more assembly, and some final. So that's robotics. We should probably get another robotics machine, but we have some time with this. Let's make, how many can we make of this? 38. Maybe we make like 10 of these just for now. See how it goes. And we probably get another robotics machine, right? Let's see. Robotics machine, where is that at? Robotics testing station, perfect. I think we have just two. Probably fine. Let's get a billboard for it. Right there. And there we go. And then we can link this up with both. And then let's shove all these back on the billboard once it's built. And that should be good. Alrighty. So this should be handling the office desks, that assembly. This up here should be handling all the sandboxes. And this assembly right here should handle all the stuff for the mini bots. We'll see how quick the mini bots get done. I don't have any real faith that the mini bots are gonna go quick, but we'll see, we'll see. I still don't know why they're putting everything here when there's this area here. Priority three, priority three. Yeah, I don't know why they keep skipping this area. You think they're just unloaded here and be done with it. All right, see if we get stuff done. Oh, let's also overdrive that. Yeah, there they go, they're smelting. It's good to go. Let's also make sure these are all done. Yeah, uh, looks like they're still working on some sandboxes for that, but that's fine. We got a ton of wheels to make for the mini bots first. Three desk already done. That's actually really good. I still don't know why they're just going straight for this. Oh, I know what we could do to help increase some efficiency here. What, what do you want? What do you want? Go away. Let's remodel. Let's add a door. Oh, if we could add a door right there. Maybe if we just like add a door here. 
that'll cut down on some walking. And maybe if we can move this shelf and add a door there, like right behind that shelf, they just cut right through. There you go. Maybe that'll speed things up too. Probably not necessary to add a third door here. I mean, that's a pretty short walk there. All right, they're cranking through the office desk. I appreciate that. For sure. And we definitely want to deliver what we can before prices keep on dropping. All right, once we start think seeing things get in the yellow, we'll repair them. So what's going on with this? Is this take taking forever? Oh, we're gonna, oh, rats. Rats, we haven't dealt with rats in forever. Catch them. Oh, this is gonna suck. You know what? We actually need more injection presses, I think. Should be, where is it? Should be a little guy. Foam injection machine? That's not it. We're looking for the injection press. There it is. Oh, we'll put that there. And let me get one more in here. Like at this point, it's gonna be crowded and the mood's not gonna be great in here. But we need things working better. All right, we got our cannon. Oh my god. I suck. I can't hit him. How can I get him? This is such a small range. Nice. There we go. What does that mean? They just can't get to a workbench or something? All right, we good? Someone come through this door. Come through the door. Nope, I guess they're not coming through here. So we gotta move this, looks like over here. Oh, now you come through this door. Gotcha. Come on, rant. Come on, rat. Wow, they're just avoiding this room. I mean, smart if they don't want to get nuked. All right, let's move this. Much quicker if we put this in here. Speed things up. Let's go, let's go. Oh, thanks. Built that quick. All right, three left. Two left. One left. Oh, there he is. All right. 11 grand. Get that out. All right, 21 dust made, all right. Let's see how many of these we can sell, 21. 22. Once a good 10 hours or so. Yeah, we'll sell these. We'll get them out. Keep the money flowing. How's all the... Okay, they're starting to get bad. Not terrible, but they're getting there. Okay, let's sell these 30 buckets. Oh, nice, we leveled. That means we can go into R&D. Go over here, and we want... The better materials, where's that at? Is this it? Premium materials, there we go. Now we can more easily get our little requirements ready, or we can meet the requirements for the contracts a lot better than completely switching out parts. How'd our revenue go? Wow, we're still really low? Eugh, that's not good. Even with all those office desks we just sold, Okay, 61 of these still that is not terrible and We're gonna deliver another 22 of them is that right? No 18 of them so we can make another 30 probably 
can be golden. Uh, did I reposition all these like this? Make sure everything's there for that and then execute that. So we'll do more office desks. All right, how are my workers? We have two technicians, which is fine. 14 advanced woodworkers, which is fine because we have four for this, four for this. This is a lathe. Okay, so we're not using any of that for advanced woodworking. What else do we got? Haulers, 10 general operators, seven assembly specialists. Maybe we get more assembly specialists. I'm gonna hire a little bit more workers. It's like five. I feel like we have too many idle machines again. Like still, as long as stuff's being made, I'm pretty happy. All right, just gotta make sure things don't blow up here. All right, please finish these desks. Please, please, please. Come on, there's like two dust left. What are you doing? All the parts should be ready. Just assemble it. There you go. Deliver that. Get it out. All right, we working on the bots? Looks like we are. Oh, 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 we built those injection presses. Did we, we did not link those, did we? There we go. And then now, while it's paused, I will send everything back to this billboard and then it will divvy it out. I think that's really slowing us down on robotics as well. There we go. Now it should start sending out. Let's see if sandboxes and mini bots start taking off now. It should. Now we can do the injection press. Three different stations. All right, bots are going. Sandbox kits just suck. That was a terrible thing to make, I think. Oh, breakpoints. Wow, we're really running out of breakpoints? Could expand again. We could expand again. Get another tiny break room. I feel like another break room. Maybe just a secondary break room off here. But this is like a huge plot to buy, I think. Yeah, 29,000. Could just buy a plot down there. I don't really feel like buying this giant plot over there. Let's just wait. Let's see how our breakpoints are doing. Maybe that's just a fluke that they just happened to pass out there. Actually, it might be the cause of the mood, right? Oh, the mood in there is not terrible. Mood in here sucks. Ugh. Although they're not really working in that room too much, so that's not terrible. All right, let's turn that off. Turn that view off. All right, get these buckets done and get them out. You know, let's trigger some repairs. These things are starting to break down. There we go. Okay, sandboxes. They being done. Four more left. Another market refresh soon, and we have not really sold anything. So our revenue is going to take a hit again. Our net worth is slowly, slowly climbing. So that's not bad. But yeah, our revenue, we need to figure that out. We're just not producing things fast enough. And I don't know how to speed that up. Like, they seem to be working, but then we have a lot of idle workers doing nothing. 
So I, I just don't know how we speed that up anymore. Like we have four stations of almost everything. Like the important stuff, like glue stations. We actually have like eight glue stations. We have a, a bunch of advanced table saws. Ooh. Off to this. Ooh, what's back? Tall drawer. <gasps> this could be our thing. This could be our thing. The tall drawer. Let's go for it. Plan product. 175. We'll make... How? Oh, we don't have a plan for this one yet. 15 and 24. Let's go for... No, we don't want metal. Alright, let's just start a new one. I want a... Basic wood handle. It's fine. Let's do all the basic woods, as always. And then we'll go from there. Alright. All the basic woods. Need more strength. Ooh. Little expensive. Little expensive. So let's go a tier up on the wood. See what happens. Ooh. One strength short. Alright. So we need to get to three strength on something, which there's nothing obvious that we can change. We could change this two to three strength, two to three strength. Yeah, we can't change that. Nothing about this we can change. What about this? Yeah, nothing with that. So one of these has to be the really good wood, probably this. And that should do it, which means we can actually take one of these down. Oh, that looks so bad. It looks so bad. What about the front? There, sure. I don't even care why, Why I don't even know why I care what it looks like. Let's make 60 of these. And let's set up the plan for this. So we'll cut there. We'll cut this there. Oh, wow, this is a lot of cutting. Cut that there. Cut this over there, that over there. We'll glue. A lot of bending being done. We have three of them, but we have a lot of other, like gluing and stuff that needs to be done. So bending should be able to keep up with that. We'll do that there. A lot of gluing, oh my God. And we'll do final assembly. You know what, we could probably do final assembly over there. I know we were going to separate it, but I think this tall drawers are probably going to save us. And then I think we'll finish the mini bots. One of finishing mini bots before we really get to tall drawers assembling over here. So that should be fine. All right, people, let's go. And also, let's call for volunteers. Let's get some volunteers in here. All right, people, let's move, move, move. So yeah, we're just going for this revenue. See if we get there. Come on, people, unload. Jeez. No one helped unload there. Wow, they didn't unload anything. Oh my god, he's still tossing stuff from the truck. I mean, to be honest, that's a little quicker than even us unloading. Holy crap, that's a lot of wood. My god! Oh, oh, oh! Can I get a shelf in here? Wait, does that work? Does that work there? Doesn't look like that would work there. Look like it overlapped, but I guess it does work. Start putting stuff on the shelves, please. Yes, they're using the shelves. Here, let me move this water cooler. Move it in that corner. Get out of the way. There we go. They're putting more things on the shelves. That's beautiful. And then let's overdrive that. Okay, we gotta watch these glue stations. Make sure they don't catch on fire. Because, you know, glue's highly flammable, apparently. Get these office desks done. Get them out. Come on. Got one more. Put it all together. There you go. Sell them. Get them out. And these robots are actually pretty close to done. 
Looks like we're on final stages. Probably like the arms and then the testing. And then we can start hammering through these tall drawers, hopefully. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Nice, 25 grand. All right, come on. Get the mini bots done. What are we waiting on? Just assembly? Jeez, then assemble, people. Assemble, assemble, assemble. Wow, we already got a drawer done. That's what I like to see, getting those drawers done quick. Oh, break points. It looks like we're barely hitting the break points, so it might just be a case of if we just add a little bit better recovery, we'll be golden. Okay, break points there. Let's see. Do we have a TV? I think we have a TV in there already. Fridge we don't have. Okay. Let's order that. Let's see. What's down here? We have that. We have a chess table. Don't have foosball. Whatever. We'll add it like right in the center. Because we don't care if they're slow when they're on break. Okay, that should be good. That looks like it's fully stocked. Oh, this doesn't have a fridge. We're going to add that. There we go. That should help with breakpoint recovery per day. So hopefully it gets us a little bit more breakpoints per day. While we are actually making these drawer units not... Terribly slow. It's actually a surprise to me. Definitely gotta make sure all this is repaired. Don't want this stuff blown up. Alright, sell those bots. Get them out. Get the bots out, get the bots out. Nice. All right, what's new? Ooh, tables. Uh, 347. What just popped in? What just popped in? Was it this? Okay, so we got drawers. We're making a ton of them. 60 out of 68. Ooh, office desk. Is this what we were just making? I think it was. But we're focusing on these tall drawers. If we can get these tall drawers done, I think we're gonna be sitting pretty. Everything's overdrive, so they're working like crazy. We're woodworking machines right now. I mean, ideally, if I could get some metal working going, something that's strictly metal only. What about this grill? No, I didn't even make a grill. I was gonna say, then we can... I could do something like this. I don't think that'll help too much, though. I need something that's strictly just, like, metal. Straight metal. And isn't gonna interfere with the woodworking at all. I mean, this one's not bad. Why are all these plants here when there's nothing there? Plan four, sure. Oh, wow. No, that's too many steps. Way too many steps. All right, keep making these drawer units, people. I mean, our idle workers keep getting to 20 down to zero, so we have a lot of workers that are constantly doing stuff. So as long as we don't have an overabundance of idle workers, I think we're fine having just one contract to open it's when it constantly sits at like 20 idle workers but it's constantly going up then back down to zero so we know it's just like leftovers from when they're going on break and stuff so i think we're good and as soon as this clears out we're at some more shelves in here it'll make it so they can walk through here a lot quicker oh look how nice they're lining up these drawers it actually looks really awesome, getting all those lined up. Tall drawers for the win! Come on, let's get these done. What's our... where'd we get? 
Oh, our revenue went up. That's not bad. Went up by three. Three thousand. Our net worth went up a bit. We're above net worth of Nemesis Inc. now. And I think that's all we have to do. Yeah, the Nemesis Inc. We don't have to be number one. We just have to be higher than him. Which we are. Now we just need a higher revenue. I don't know how he has a revenue of 20,000. That's insane. I really just want to hold onto these while the price goes up. But if the demand goes below 60, we're going to be hurting. Come on, people. Move, move, move. Alright, everything's still good. See, right now, like, so much of my shop is not being used because of metalworking and stuff. Let's see. There's got to be something I can work on. Like, I strictly just want something that's metal only. And that would be, like, this grill... But it's not even worth it at a 380 a unit? That really is not worth it. 29 strength, 17 style. Can I do something with this? That's a lot of metal. It's a little bit of cutting. Can I change this to like a metal top? Oh, I can. A completely metal table. Nice. I I guess it doesn't matter what I would change for that. Alright, I think we can actually pull this off. Let's assemble all this in the back then. Okay, so we got some extra metal working going. And that should be good. Do that contract. This is a timed one though, so we need to watch out for that. Maybe we just put that on top, so they work on that first. That was probably a bad idea now that I think about it, because it's timed. I mean, I guess as long as they finish ahead of schedule, but still. The tall drawers are where our money maker was at. Oh, wood bending. Oh, don't want those to catch on fire. Okay, what's new? What's new? What's new? Oh, it dropped. That's not good. That is not good. Okay, office desks are going up, so we need to keep making office desks as well. I almost just want to sell all my metalworking machines and go straight woodworking. Woodworking is so much quicker for us, I think. Alright, they're still working on the tall drawers, so that's good. Even though we have adjustable tables on the top. Come on, come on. Our revenue tanked. What? Our revenue just went all the way down. Our, ne our net worth is still above, which is I'm good with, but our revenue. How much money your factory has generated this week? Oh, is it by week? Hmm. That's That kind of sucks, because I also don't know what the week is. It's just showing me, like, days. Every two days. There's no, like, calendar in here, I don't think. Yeah, there's, like, no calendar, so I can't tell. Daily average. Payments received 6250. Well, that's because we didn't really sell anything. I think we'll get all these tall drawers done in this market period, though. Come on, come on, come on. And what's with these tables? Why aren't these going? There we go. Number seven. Come on, keep making the legs. As long as someone's constantly working over here, I'm happy. What is that noise? Something on fire? Let's repair these. And get these repaired. Get that one repaired. That should be good. All right, I hope we can get this done before the market refresh. That'd be really nice. Come on. So many idle workers here. They're just standing. I 
Got some tier three workers here. All right, almost done with this contract. Just on final assembly, it looks like. All right, just need the tabletop there. It's gonna be one heavy table if it's completely metal. Come on, someone make the table. Someone make the table. Are you kidding me right now? What are you guys doing? Look, look at how long this is taking to get made. Jeez. Oh yeah, we're not getting this tall drawers done. We are not getting those done. The revenue is going to drop like crazy as well. 62.50. Let's see what it gets to now. Ooh, that hurts. That hurts. So I guess it is a week's worth. Like, total. So new is the buckets. We're definitely not doing that. We need to stay with woodworking. Oh my god, that's so much fun. Oh no, tall drawers. We gotta deliver what we have before demand keeps going down. That was stupid of me. I should have delivered what I had before that market refresh. Now we got all this extra drawers sitting around that we can't deliver. Good thing is we can hold on to them to see if any more demand comes back. All right, let's get these sold. Look at that, 77,000. That actually got us about 30 grand more than what we had. Oh, fortunately we can't see our current revenue. We gotta wait till market refresh every time. I wish the revenue or and net worth were just like constant average running total, like update it once per hour. It sucks that you have to wait for the two days, and then even then, it doesn't seem to really tell me exactly how the revenue is calculated. It says it's calculated over, like, the week, but you can't tell what a week is, because everything is also in two days, and a week is seven days, so it's really confusing. But I think we're going to have to call it here. Don't want this episode going crazy long. Hopefully, with any luck, on the next episode, if we keep pushing through with some more office desks and maybe some more tall drawers. Hopefully that amount we just sold will get us above this 20,000 revenue that somehow this Nemesis Inc. is pulling off. And then we can finally get this champion milestone done. But until then, take it easy, everyone.